So many rotting in their graves, and you're still standing. Your kin, your comrades, the towns and villages you've arrived too late to save. So what? Are these weaklings truly your friends? Do you think keeping them alive makes up for all those you've failed? And? What's your blood prize for the elf? The Zenith? The wizard? I know you thought about it. How heavy would the purse have to be? Yeah? What's your point? You're a poor soldier, Marcus Kruber. Soldiers take orders. They win their battles. Go annoy someone else. Always too slow, aren't you? Tardy with warnings, with blade work, with the truth. So what? What happened to you? You used to do anything for a coin and a full tankard. Are those days truly behind you? Or is this just an act? Go annoy someone else. Have you ever wondered what the Pact's Sworn might pay? You could be a power, a warlord, a king. Yeah? What's your point? How many men have you trained? How many actually marched back from war? And? You're not a hero, you're not a champion. They're not your friends. You're a mercenary. Coin is your bread, and blood your wine. Go annoy someone else. King Rorik, Granite Hand will never forgive you. Your clan will never forgive you. You're not real! Does it get tiring, Gorikson? Looking for something you've no intention of finding? So many lies? That's not true! A horde of Skaven, and every sentry save you, already dead. If you'd been quicker, that gutter runner would never have cut you open. So why don't you tell them about your failure? Why not admit it, Gorikson? You don't care about Karakzorn, but Seeker is better than Exile, isn't it? That's not true! Barden Gorikson, always ready with a joke, a song, anything to drown your past. They trust you. They don't see your weakness, your shame. They will. You won't be able to help yourself. And no song will hide that truth. Ziflin Deeps. A word from you and so many would still be alive. But you weren't there, were you? You're not real! If you'd been stronger, you'd have reached the hold in time. The slaughter of Ziflin Deeps would be only a nightmare. You're not real! So many dead from your weakness. Dwimbarg, Grum, Sindri, Harkon, Emelda, Gorin, even Morden, your son. That's not true! Reich fell. Thousands of blameless souls cast to the void. No. Go away. The Dryads delighted in your bitterness and your pride. They spun tales of coming darkness and deeds that would see the Lord's court beg your pardon. Please. No. 
Do you think Lilith can save you? Why should she bother with a spiteful, broken thing like you? Lilith. Lilith, preserve me. Even Araloth didn't understand. Noble, perfect Araloth. He doesn't know you hate him, does he? He has everything that should be yours. Get out of my head! You've always felt more kinship with the Dryads of the Forest than your own kind, haven't you? No. Go away. In Triple Eagles Reich, you set in motion the very events you sought to stop. A bloated clan fester devouring Athelborn. You must be so proud. Lilith, Lilith, preserve me. You are damned by your own hand, little elf. You are proud. You belong to the darkness, to the dark gods. Get out of my head! your kills all you like. Repay Uber's Reich's slaughter a dozenfold, a hundred. It will change nothing. Please, no. The Dryads warned that Uber's Reich would play a role in the waning of the Elves, so you led the slaughter of a military convoy bound for the city. Please, no. You've always known better, always been better. That's why the Lord's Court took you to task. They were jealous. Lilius, Lilius, preserve me. You don't belong with them, Carillion. You know this, I know this. Cut their throats and have done. Get out of my head! That staggered off Burgermeister's daughter, did you? She pleaded for mercy as you drove home the stake. Blessed Sigma, shelter me! Your father was a blacksmith, a strong man, an uncompromising man. Who do you see in the mirror, Victor? I am deaf to your accusations. You are no different to those you hunt, little Victor, dripping with blood and pride, blind to your nature. <laughs> the Grey Seer saw your truth when he took your eye, didn't he? Silence! Sigmar is dead, little Victor. He's been dead for millennia. That fire you feel isn't faith. It's failure. I am dead to your accusations. Is it Sigmar you fight for, Victor? Or your own slighted pride? Blessed Sigmar, shelter me! Little Victor, so blinded by purpose, even your order thinks you a fool. What would these others say if they knew? <laughs> they scathe and deceived you at Skagadorf. Their web of intrigue with greedy men and thirsting dead. That's really why you hate them, isn't it? The others think you miss your eye, but they're wrong. It's a sacrifice, a pledge that you will never be so blind as you were at Skagadorf. Silence! Is your faith wavering, little Victor? Your veins are so cold where once raged a flame. Blessed Sigma, shelter me! You're too ready to believe in authority. You heed your faith too late. That's why Skagadorf burned. <laughs> 
Sienna, you'd have them believe the flame is wild, that it is beyond your control. But the flame is only wild because you are wild. It's past. It's done. Friends betray you, then they burn. Ramblers of fear will be next. But of course, it won't be your fault, will it? It'll be the flame. Blah, blah, blah. No one cares. Do you remember Rambler? He helped you harness your gifts, and you burned him alive for it. I can't hear you. How long have you hidden in fire's embrace? Numb to life, to people. You're an addict. You always have been. Not listening. How is your temper these days, Sienna? Does it flare? Does it boil? Do you remember what it led you to in the past? It's past. It's done. Kill them now, Sia. They'll betray you. Everyone always has. Blah, blah, blah. No one cares. How many times a night do you long to burn them all? Just because you can. You've done it before. I can't hear you. Don't you want to see that flesh curl and the skin burn? Remember, Rambler? The scream is the sweet scent of his death. Not listening. You play the hero, Sienna, but your past is strewn with ashen dead. You're every bit as dangerous as Victor believes. Not listening. You're a broken thing, Sienna. An angry child screaming with flame. You've never been accepted. You never will be. Blah, blah, blah. No one cares. You burn Sienna to save Sophia from the pyre. Only she was exactly what the Inquisitor claimed, wasn't she? It's past. It's done.